Hello and welcome back to our Treble D Beach House series. In the last two videos we've been polishing up level one and two. Now we're going to fine tune the stairs that connect them. If we take a look at plan level one, we can see the stairs. But on plan level two, they're not there. This is because the stairs are nested in the level one group. We need to fix that up. We do it by using a process that gets used a lot in SketchUp, paste in place. It's very handy for moving objects between layers and groups. If we open up the layers menu, we might get a better idea of what's happening. We open up the level one group, select the stairs, go to edit, then copy, then delete. We then click in outer space to close the group, then we go to edit and paste in place. The stairs are now in place outside the group. Stairs have their own layer and each floor scene is already set to show that layer. So now if we go to level 2 scene, the stairs are there. If we go to plan level 2, the stairs are there. Now we're going to adjust our text. We've rotated and flipped a lot of stuff so the text is looking a bit scattered. Working in the level 1 scene, we go to the layers menu and enable text. We just keep double clicking on it until we see it highlighted like this. We then right click and flip along red for right to left flips. And flip along green for top to bottom flips. We then move to level 2 and do the same thing. If we need to rotate text, like in the main bedroom here, we use the rotate tool. We click once on the text around the base of a letter, in around the middle here somewhere, then stretch out and grab the base of another letter, then crank the text around and click again when it clunks into place at 90 degrees. Keep an eye on the window in the bottom right corner. Then adjust the text with the move tool. Now we check our floor plans and it's looking good. Next we'll put the roof on. If it's all too hard or if you just don't have the time, please feel free to contact us at Treble D. We have very modestly priced consultants who can help you out with construction drawings or any aspect of the design process. Cheers.